Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Thursday, the third, <laughs> I think. I can't remember the days. <laughs> Anyways, I'm feeling really good, so I'm gonna take advantage. And June is behind y'all snapping. <laughs> also, I got um, laundry going, so off. Cue the baby. <laughs> okay, false alarm, I think. She went back to sleep. <laughs> Anyways, I have some happy mail that I got over the last week or so that I wanted to share with you guys so that I could put it away um, because it's just sitting on my table and I like to share it so that you guys know that I got it <laughs> but um, yeah so I got some cards and a pack a couple packages so first I got this card right here it's a really cute card from Erica in New Jersey I really like this card it reminds me of, like gemstones and I like gemstones I collect stones and things and so it reminds me of it's just a really pretty card and um, I got this couple weeks ago <laughs> but I was um busy a week ago <laughs> but uh yeah so thank you so much for that and um what is oh that's the that's the cup in the washer <laughs> I was like what is the noise okay but thank you so much for sending me this little card just let me know that um you appreciate my videos and stuff it's, and it had a cat sticker and I accidentally killed the cat <laughs> I tried to keep it alive and I actually decapitated it <laughs> I feel bad but thank you so much for that and this one is from Marie. This is a, uh, a baby card. <laughs> oh, this is so cute. It's like a congratulatory card for having a baby. <laughs> it's hard to see. It's super cute. So thank you so much for thinking of me and writing your note and uh, sending this to us. So thank you so much for that. And it's pink. <laughs> the envelope's pink. And this one I got today. Sorry about the washer, but uh, we need laundry. <laughs> This is from Janelle, and I got this one today. This is so cute. It's the cutest little thing ever. And it's like a homemade card. Look at the front. It says new baby, and it's got a um, little crochet dress on it. That is so precious. And then inside, there's just a note, you know, congratulating us for having the baby. But isn't that the cutest thing ever? That is so sweet. Thank you so much, Janelle. You've sent a lot of stuff our way, and I appreciate it so much. I like your, um, her address label's got yarn on it. That's cool. I need to make some more of those. I had some made and I used them all up, so now I need to make some more. But thank you so much for that. Okay, that's the letters. And then the package, this one here I got for Jesse today. This is from Ann. She wanted to send him something, um, you know, just as a big brother gift. <laughs> and he's gonna love this. He's at school right now. Let's see here. Yeah, it's like 1230, <laughs> I forgot what time it is. So he's, he's, he hasn't seen this yet. And, um, I, uh, I know he's gonna be super excited when he comes home and sees this. So first, there's a puzzle, which he loves. We love puzzles here. And it is a Rainforest Search and Find puzzle. It's got 64 pieces, which is good for him. And um, you put it together and then you gotta find the stuff that's on the puzzle. So this is really cool. He's gonna love this. We'll probably end up doing this today in the floor. I wonder how big it is, does it say? Um, I'm sure it does somewhere. Maybe. Uh, maybe not. <laughs> oh, right here. It's 59. Oh, wait, that's centimeters. 23 inches by 15 inches. That's pretty. It's pretty good size. It's basically two foot by like a foot, a little over a foot. Um, rectangle. <laughs> so that's cool. He's gonna love that. And the next thing he's gonna also love, because he loves um, reptiles and amphibians and things like that. <laughs> And it's a Reptile and Amphibians <laughs> sticker activity book from National Geographic. So it's got all kinds of um, stickers, which he loves. He gets that from me. I love stickers. <laughs> all kinds of cool stickers. And activity pages, which he loves, of course. What five-year-old doesn't like stuff like that? But we're going to be doing this a lot, I'm pretty sure. But he loves um, snakes and frogs and lizards and all that kind of stuff. So I know he's going to love that. So thank you so much, Ann, for sending that. He's going to be super excited. I did open it. I know uh, I probably should let him open it, but I'm a protective parent, so I always pre-open everything that's sent straight to him so that I know what's in it <laughs> before I give it to him. And plus, sometimes um, people send things that he can't have right away, like gum and things, and he can't be not be trusted with gum <laughs> anymore. Uh, he made mess with gum a few times, so now he's not allowed to have gum until he's older. But anyways, I always just pre-open, you know. I'm just a parent, so I do. This next package, this is not the box it came in. <laughs> this is just an empty box I happen to have. Uh, this one came from Violet in Oregon. <laughs> and she made some gifts for the baby and then sent me the leftover yarn so that I can uh, 
make more things that go with it. And look at the card. <laughs> it's an alpaca, I think. It's so cute. <laughs> I still have all my Christmas cards up. I don't know if I'll ever take them down. But let me get to the gifts and then I'll throw the leftover yarn balls. Okay, so first there's this little, um, what you call it? Like a first aid kit type thing that she packed. Is that what she called it? Yeah, <laughs> basically like, and it's just got, it's got some of that bug stuff that makes you not itch when you get a mosquito bite. <laughs> and it's got a thermometer, anti-itch spray, which I, I will definitely need that this summer because me and Jesse both get like swarmed by mosquitoes. And then some tubes. So those are handy. Thank you so much. She also put these mailers in there, which is cool. I could definitely use these. They're really pretty too. But they're just um, really shiny. <laughs> um, they're kind of like a rose gold color mailers. So those are neat. I will use, I'll put that in my stash of mailing stuff and I'll use them eventually, probably with when I get back to sewing and stuff for little things. And now to the gifts, the best part, the funner part. <laughs> so she made two washcloths and uh, it's made with big twist cotton. So here's one, really pretty, like an orange cream is what it reminds me of. What's it called? Tangerine Splash is what the yarn's called. Reminds me of like cream sickles. So there's two of those. And this is the leftover yarn. It's big twist cotton. So I can make more. And then this is a, um, what's it called? Like a wipes container, I think is what it is. Let me read the note. Yes, that's, that's just making sure I got that right. But like you put uh, the baby wipes in here and there's a hole for you to pull them out. And then some diapers over here. And then it's like a clutch, you know, so you can carry it. And it's really pretty rainbow yarn. I've had some of this yarn before. This is Karen Simply Soft Rainbow Bright. Yeah, I, I had some of this before. I can't remember what I made, but she sent me this uh, skein of it. And then also inside the pocket, there's like a little scrap ball. <laughs> so I can use that to make other things with. It's so pretty. And then a baby blanket that's knit. I absolutely love knitted baby blankets. They're so squishy and soft. I wish I could knit better, but I don't really want to learn. <laughs> I'm just gonna stick to crochet. But here's the um, little baby blanket. I've had this yarn before too. She put the ball bed in here. This is a uh, Premier uh, Sweet Roll. This is the gelato one, I think. No, birthday cake pop. Yeah. I remember I had this. Um, I made a cow set out of it a long time ago. It's so pretty and it's knitted, so it's squishy. And uh, definitely we'll be using that. We're going through blankets because she's a baby. <laughs> and then she also sent this ball of baby yarn. Uh, it's called Red Heart Baby Soft Nursery. <laughs> Ooh, it's like pastel baby colors. And then there's these three balls of this yarn. It's pink with like a, a white, uh, like a, I think it's white, <laughs> like thread through it. So it's really pretty and girly, baby girl stuff. So that's what she says. Thank you so much for all that stuff. Now I gotta put it where it goes and I'm gonna hang up my cards just with my Christmas cards, I guess. I'll just keep adding to my walls and um, my, my two, my cute little baby ones, and then my gym one and my alpaca or llama. <laughs> so I'll hang those up to the wall. I don't know when I'll ever take them down because I just don't want to. <laughs> I know the walls will be empty when I take them down. But yeah, so that is what I got in the Happy Mail last um, couple weeks maybe <laughs> I think that's it oh I did get one more gift off of our baby registry from Kelly which is crochet mall for life um but June is sitting on it right now <laughs> it's a baby blanket and I love that baby blanket I use it every day with her um it's the one she sleeps with actually I swaddle her in it because it's really soft and warm and uh it's pretty it's real curly and but she's laying on it right now in her swing and um snoozing away so but I did get it, so thank you so much to Kelly for buying it and know that she's using it all the time. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, so thank everybody for their gifts. It's definitely never, like, expected or anything, but it's always appreciated. And I know Jesse's going to be super excited when he gets home from school when he sees this uh, puzzle in this book. I know I'm going to be in the floor with him later doing that puzzle. Um, 
but yeah so I'm gonna hop off here and get this edited before the baby wakes up and then I gotta finish up that laundry uh, I, Devin's already in bed and I forgot to get the hangers so I guess I can't finish it up I can get it out of the dryer <laughs> but I can't hang it up until later but that's okay so uh, yeah but um, I'm pretty rested I feel pretty much normal back to normal um, you know I'm still recovering <laughs> but um, I definitely feel better my spinal headaches are gone which I'll talk about that when I can record a like a delivery story because I had you naturally but it was not my choice I was in the process of getting an epidural when she decided to pop out <laughs> so they had to they got the epidural in the um, catheter in my back but they never got to put the medicine in which is a good thing because I didn't have to pay for it <laughs> but it's a bad thing because I felt everything and I wasn't prepared to feel everything you know I was expecting to get medicine but um, she just shot out like a rocket so <laughs> um, yeah so I ended up having spinal headaches for three days after she was born and it's pretty rough those were really bad <laughs> but um, they're gone and I feel mostly back to normal. My stomach feels really weird. It's so empty now <laughs> and flat. I've, I'm already back to my pre-pregnancy weight, which is cool because <laughs> it took me a lot longer with Jesse to get down. But, um, and now my clothes are like, they feel ginormous because I'm used to being stretched out, you know, with my big belly. Um, so yeah, but anyways, I'll talk more. I'll do a real chatty. It'll probably be really long <laughs> that day. Um, birth story, I guess. Uh, and uh, hopefully soon. I'm trying to think. Devin's off this weekend already. <laughs> he he was on paternal paternity leave, and he goes back for two days, and he's back off again for the weekend. So um, maybe I can do it that day. I'll have him just watch her, so I can sit and chat forever. <laughs> maybe I'll get like a mindless project and it'll be like a crochet and chat. <laughs> That's what I'll do. I'll start a blanket or something. <laughs> I need something to do. But I'm like this close to starting a cardigan because my yarn's sitting over there and it's like staring at me, and I'm staring at it, and I want to make that cardigan, even though it's going to be getting warm soon. But still. <laughs> but anyways, this blanket also, I'll link it down below because I know someone's going to ask. It was a, it's a dishcloth pattern, I believe, that you can also turn into a blanket from, I believe, your inspirations. I'll try to find it and link it below because I'm sure someone will ask. <laughs> um, they usually do when I have something in the background. But uh, it's my Valentine's Day blanket. I love it. But I'm going to hop off here and uh, get stuff going. Today's my first day with Jessie at school, her here, and Je Devin in bed. <laughs> and tonight's my first night with the two kids by myself. So I'm a little nervous, but um, I know it'll be okay. <laughs> Jesse's old enough, you know, that he understands that I have to do stuff for her um, and then, you know, deal with whatever he needs at the time. But yeah, so I'm a little nervous, but I, I got this. <laughs> so I'm gonna hop off here and I will see you guys soon i hope because i am feeling a lot better and i want to start putting out videos because i miss talking to you guys and i miss um just being me and blabbing and being busy a lot i know people are, are going to tell me to rest but i am actually resting really well she does sleep surprisingly well for a newborn she's a little bit grumpier than jesse was though so i don't know how long that's gonna last but um i'm feeling good so i'm gonna take advantage of feeling good and do stuff but uh with that being said i'm gonna hop off here and uh i'll see you guys whenever i see you guys <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Do you like her? What is that? Yeah, she's cute. Yeah. She's really cute, ain't she? I think she might want her thing. Here, you want me to take her? Yeah.